Um, I'm really excited tonight because um, we ha I have a, a colleague um, and my uh, UK EU um, partner distributor. Um, so the Remy now is in uh, Europe, which is real excited. And um, I have to tell you, uh, it's a privilege to have Sumas come on. He's uh, a really unique uh, uh, physician. Um, he, he has a lot to offer. He's taught me already. He's taught me a lot about lasers. And um, so it's always good to get a, a, an excellent perspective from across the pond. Is that how we say it, Sumas? Across the pond? Uh, yeah, I, that's the word I heard quite a lot. <laughs> and we're going to talk about, I just want to briefly, uh, quickly review just some uh, importance about the Remy and some uh, improvements uh, we're going to talk about. Um, but uh, it's the focus is on warts tonight and any other information and topics that you want to talk about and Sumas wants to talk about. Um, so the Remy, I've kind of uh, made a mnemonic. It's portable. It's only four pounds. It's powerful, very powerful. We're talking a 30 watt peak power laser and it's multifunction. And that's what's really important. I've always felt to get a, and the last part is affordable. But the multi-function is, is just as important. We need a laser that just doesn't do pain, just doesn't do fungus, just doesn't do warts. It has an expansion. Uh, and Sumas is going to touch on that because we touched on it right before. So I don't mind you pointing out, Sumas, if you want to talk about the future, matricectomies and why, spider veins is why. The Remy is an amazing device in that it can expand into other areas because it's FDA cleared not only for fungus, pain, and warts, but it's ablation, which is uh, incision, evaporation, dermatology, and surgery. Now, one of the things that we have advanced into is we all have iPhones or Androids, and the Remy now can be in an Android uh, uh, form. An Android, um, it's the same Remy, but it has much more sophisticated software in it to where you can really pin down, and, and, and Sumas is going to talk about with the warts what he's done. Both Remy's do everything, but uh, Android is interesting because you can upgrade protocols. It's like your iPhone. You can upgrade it at any time halfway around the world, and that's what I like about the Android. Uh, I mean, I'm old. I'm, I'm very basic where I like, you know, it's simple, but the more and more I've started to use the Android, and, and Sumas has introduced the Android to the UK and Europe, and he uses it. Um, thanks for being the guinea pig, uh, Simmons, because you've really, uh, you've done a lot. I got to tell you something. You have a lot more patience than I do. But I'm getting more and more I've gotten impressed with the Android. And tonight, um, uh, I will tell you, we do have some Androids in stock. Uh, it's going to be more expensive to put Android uh, out into the market. But tonight, anybody that wants an Android will get it the same price as the Remy standard software. Um, both are great lasers. There's nothing wrong with it, but uh, Android can always be upgraded. Uh, right now, if you want to upgrade the, uh, we're talking about software with the Remy uh, standard dual. They're both dual, dual, by the way. You have to get a da download a chip, put the chip in, da 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 da. This way, boom, it's done instantaneously right through, right into your computer. You have videos. Sumas has used it more than I have, so he can probably tell you his his viewpoint on it. But it's it's um. I don't know, maybe I'm getting old, but I mean, I've worked with this Android and it's uh, I'm starting to fall in love with it. Uh, so that being said, I want to introduce uh, Sumas, um, uh, amazing gentleman, um, uh, and there's a lot to learn from him, uh, but he's really a nice guy and down to earth and wants to teach you and learn. Uh, and it's, it's a, it's a two way street. He can learn from you, but I'll tell you one thing I've learned. I thought, you know, that definition of an expert is somebody that continues to learn. And I've learned a lot from Sumas and I appreciate it. So Sumas, welcome. Uh, what time is it where you are? Midnight? Uh, good morning or good, good night. What? It's midnight. So first of all, I'm so privileged that I am in a platform with you as, um, I do have a bit of connection with the USA because I did my minimal in, in invasive surgery with the Academic of Ambulative Foot and Ankle Surgery, 2004, right? That was, so I did go to uh, Louisiana State University, something like that. So, uh, and, and obviously podiatry profession throughout the world differs from country to country, unfortunately. The, it, we don't have a fully unified 
profession throughout the world. It's just each country has a scope of practice, probably suit their own need. But anyway, with the remedy. Can I, can I just ask you a question? Because it's I, I want to talk about that topic a little bit. Because okay. you treat laser therapy from head to toe. Am I correct about that? Yes, because I can have multi-qualification because I am also a sports practitioner. So I switch. So I'm a podiatrist. So when I do podiatry, I stick to podiatry profession. When I do whole body, then I use the uh, sports practitioner's life, um, qualification. So I, I, I switch around whatever suits me. I personally believe we got to have a contingency plan in this day and age of medicine because we can all get some type bit of a uh, slap in our hand from our regulatory body so i could switch to uh, sports therapy or sports therapist where there is no regulation unfortunately so i can practice that uh, discipline without regulate uh, regulation uh, let, me, let me ask another question sumas is that Tell me about your relationship with the Royal College of uh, Physicians. That's a very prestigious organization. It is, it is the only Royal College on earth which is allowed podiatrists to be their members and fellows. No other Royal College in the world done it. And this Royal College, Royal College of Physician and Surgeon in Glasgow was um, founded in 18th century. So it's got huge history. It used to do medical qualification until I believe 1970 or something like that before it handed over to the university. So they used to um, dispense their own qualification in medicine, doctor in podiatry, or in the UK, we call it You're MBBS. Fellow. Are you a fellow? I'm a member, right? Fellowship cost 400 pound i don't want to pay. i just want, i just want to be a member of the college which is do i get knighted if i ever to me i've always looked up to that if you're a fellow of the royal college of uh yeah. physician it's like being knighted in my yeah, mind it's 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 been cream of cream right the, that's all th that's all I, I say but to be but i have seen there are so many american dpm who is currently now fellow and member of the Royal College, because it is the only Royal College on earth opened the door to the podiatrist. Yeah. So if any any podiatrist colleague of mine watching now, our, please go to the Royal College of Physicians and Surgeons in Glasgow and apply as an international podiatrist. I think they'll welcome with your open um, arm. You I have one problem with that. If, if they were to accept me, I'd be nervous. <laughs> okay. I get nervous because it's any organization that would accept me. I get nervous. I'm just okay, joking. but but it's worth giving a shot, and it it's is. quite it's quite easy if you got credential, they'll allow it, allow it in. But remember, it's come with prestige. If you become fellow of the member of the Royal College, you go any corner of Earth. True. Any corner on Earth, your credential stays there. So that's that. Anyway, we, I love we, it. I love it. It's something we, I would. I'd like to be a fellow of that organization. Someday. Yeah, just apply. Just apply for it. You, you'll you get it, hopefully. Right? <laughs> I'll tell my new you. Okay. okay um, let's talk about the Remy. Remy, uh, as I said, I, I am su such a, a, what can I say, a, in a privileged position to meet Dr. Zuckerman. And I have research on laser from class 3B I used 15 years ago. And then I met all, all sort of other laser, class fours, K laser, Celtic uh, multi. I've, I've seen it, I've tried it. And some of those laser beyond my reach, it could be 50K, well, 50,000, which roughly about what 70K in uh, dollars. And it's ridiculous. And sometimes some of the laser only does one modality, but the Remy, I say it, it does multiple modality. I say three or four modality. Currently, it's five. So if I name those five, I would say surgery, right? Uh, wound, wound, MSK, fungal, what else? Sports injury, right? 
So pain management. So you got five in one. And like Dr. Zuckerman said, that he has no middleman. So the, the system you are getting direct from manufacturers, from us to manufacturers to you. So that's the beauty about that. And end of the day, he, his philosophy, philosophy is to have the return of the investment, which all we want is plus affordable. If I can have a system, I can buy quite affordable. I can pass that on to my patient as well. So I don't need to charge thousands of pounds. I can charge a reasonable amount of money to get my return back. Also effective. That is the most important and the science behind it. So this is why I was so excited when I took the project and it was about three or four months negotiating with Dr. Zuckerman to understand each other. We had our glitch and when we started Android, Dr. Zuckerman wasn't happy. He wasn't happy at all. So I took the lot of punch, but the, our own manufacturer, we educated them. Right. And, and, and the beauty is that I don't like to put a laser out into the market unless it has a track record. And the Android did not have a track record, but thanks to you, it does. It's been used out there with multiple podiatrists. And I tell you, 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 you know, to me, I'm, I'm simple. Turn it on, use it. It's all preset. It's exactly like that. But, you know, it, you, can turn, you can put cycles in there. We're able to put more procedures in there more precisely. Um, and it doesn't cost more. That's what's the beauty. And, and, and the beauty, one of my colleagues, you know, Dr. Um, Abid Hussein, he yes. we, immediately we opened a, a website called Midland Laser Clinic. And the biggest thing, I don't know how America is in the UK. My God, I'm, I'm going to get gray. Hair. Show me evidence, show me evidence, show me evidence. Sometimes I feel like, what evidence? I believe in, I'm an Islamic faith. I believe blindly that God exists, right? So sometimes <laughs> sometime the most important thing is the clinical evidence. Other things are all academic. I'm sorry, sometimes as a practitioner, I haven't got time and patient. Long as clinically something is proven fit for purpose, fair enough, I put my hat off for those people who do huge research, right? But that's different altogether. We are clinicians. Most yes. importantly, well, I, I have to tell you something interesting, you know, and it, you, you, and if you could prepare this video, I'd like to show the video of you doing the warts. Okay, and so yes, as soon as, if, if you want help with that, can I talk while you're working with Sarah yep, on this? Yep. The funniest thing is that I'm looking at this video and it's like done in a professional studio, and uh, I'm like, where'd you get this video? Sumas has a Profession, he's invested tens of thousands of dollars in videos. I mean, uh, he's got his own studio. Here it is. D describe this, Sumas, and talk about how you're even okay. advanced before. This is a vaporization. I call it non touch, right? So, what it does is vaporize the tissue or the verruca or lesion. And if you can see it, um, I use um, eyeliner because laser penetrate dark circle and then you can see i am using a tip which is basically cold tip in the uk i'll show you in a minute what that tip is just to give a bit of skin coolness right now this there's no local anesthetic with this no no local anesthetia sir without local anesthetic the only thing patient feel is bit of warmth you expect that it's like when you do cryosurgery, we all do a podiatrist cryosurgery, it's bloody painful, right? But we do cryosurgery without local anesthetic. There's the Zuckerman tip. I call this the Zuckerman yeah, tip. I think this is your is tip, Dr. Zuckerman, but I'm just showing it two, two modality, one touch and one non-touch. See how beautiful or how easy the process is. We have to move. We have to move with the technology. The Android is a baby. We have to learn with Android, by the way. We will have a glitch. We will have a problem, but it's a machine learning. Android, we have to learn with Android. So you got I it pretty much control. I was amazed 
of how you had some suggestions and how to change it. We have the best engineers in the world um, that are that are amazing. Uh, I mean, I was just amazing how in the last three months you uh, made suggestions and it was fixed, you know. Uh, and you you've moved it. I was gonna I wasn't gonna release this until we really had a long tracker, but you brought this to the market and you're using it. And there are colleagues using it in the, uh, the UK. The beauty of it is, is you can have videos in it. Uh, there's a lot of uh, promotional things, but the fact that um, you can really precisely put protocols in it, um, you, you can do that. I mean, I can put the same protocols in, in the standard Remy, but I got to do some math formula. This is all the pre protocols are preset. They're in there. Um, but you came up with the handpiece, the non-contact, and the beauty of the non-contact. Yeah, uh, the non-contact, again, remember, um, why do you want to invent the wheels? The wheel is already invented. I just refined. I just mm -hmm. seen some other people. I just refined, tuned it, and our manufacturer, and with your help, we made affordable and really nice. I, I, I don't know if you got the tip. It's really nice. You have it. I don't have it. I, I, by the way, 20 of them are coming in uh, within the next 10 days. So they are made thanks to you. They're made. Yeah. Um, and the better beauty is that you can use do fungus and warts. What, so we're now down to two. You can go just change the zoom on it. And that can be steam uh, autoclaved, the, this and, hemp. Yeah. And, and another beauty, we have now, in, especially in the UK, because, you know, we are in the UK, we sometimes we are maverick as well. We have now introduced spider vein, the same tip. Again, you just, another tip will come and you could do spider vein on the lower limb. Right. right? Tell me about, I mean, I, I've been involved with uh, matricectomies and the Remy could always do matricectomies, but um, you know, we, you're, you're like the uh, pioneer to go out. I did it years ago with CO2 lasers, but you mentioned something about shortages. Yes, okay. There, I don't know funny. if any if any colleague of mine currently who's listening to us currently there's a throughout the world there's a shortage of phenol crystal right in the UK it's gone crazy 20 mil phenol I used to get it for roughly about 20 pounds something like that couple of days a couple of weeks ago it is 100 pound it's four times than or 100 times more than the the phenol liquid is so therefore remy remy can do alternative and okay. thanks to dr zuckerman he said he already saw remy can do uh pna tna with just like um you you going to use electrosurgery but probably remy is far safer far better because with the electrosurgery, you have to put the plate in. There's a lot of electric current. But yeah. I think Dr. Zuckerman can slightly polish that for me with the with the Remy um, in in growing toenail. Yeah, the protocols always existed. I just never brought it out because you know my habit has always been either sodium hydroxide or phenol. I mean, the the we were doing CO2 lasers in the 80s. And they're, uh, I mean, the Rebbe is FDA cleared for ablation, incision, all dermatological procedures. So uh, we'll look forward in the future for you uh, perfecting. I'll give you the formula. I mean, I have it. I've always had it. I can give you the protocols. And the nice thing about the you can put it right in there. It's not that hard. It's no, not it's that not. And probably it's far safer than chemical burn. Right. Uh, again, the shortage of this is this is where now we have to use the technology. See, with COVID, we've learned something now. Zoom call, where we are. If you, if you if you talk to me about three years ago, I wouldn't be in the platform from UK now to streaming throughout the world to America. So the technology we have to use the technology, Dr. Zuckerman. So when there was a shortage of phenol, we have to find. Another alternative, better, safer, and I'm sure a lot of our colleague who's listening to us, some probably some of them probably already using. If you do, please give us the protocol or give us, you know, let's spread that um, uh, treatment protocol or treatment procedure, right, and make better for the colleagues and for the patient. What do you think, I Dr. Zuckerman? 
I think it's a great idea and I'm willing to support you. And then I have the protocols. It's just uh, something that I never, the Remy was always able to do that. There's a lot more the Remy can do. I mean, you could, you can eat, actually do um, a fat lipolysis with the Remy, believe it or not. Uh, but you know, I just never, you know, there's, you can do the Remy for disectomies. You can Absolutely. do hernias, uh, varicose, you can do what do you call it? Um, it's Legion. a hernia, disc I, problem. I, I, and I call, we, we, we're going to do um, Remy in the UK. We're going to do skin lesion. So what we call it skin surgery, because I want the Remy to replace the electrosurgery because it oh. does far better. Electrosurgery so burning. Yeah. Yes. And Remy is laser ablation. It's a big, big, ablation. big difference. Big, uh, big difference. But it, it, we want to replace that or, or, or the procedure with Remy. That uh, is our next goal. And I'll show you something here. I think I got it here. Uh, this piece right here that I helped develop is a beautiful thing because most, I mean, unfortunately in podiatry today, everybody wants to make a fortune off of that disposable. With this, it's very inexpensive. You know, if you're going to uh, numb something up and cut out with this, you're talking about six dollars to replace it. You know, per which is which is reasonable. I, I, one thing, I'm not out to make. Uh, money on the accessories. It's either near cost or cost. But this right here, I mean, this can do, be used to cut. You can do this to cut out a disc in a, in a lower back. You can do not a hernia. What do you call it? varicose? Uh, not varicose veins. Uh, I can't think of it. You know, when you uh, when you're touching pyogenic pyogenic lesion, you can cut it out. Pinch it, cut it out. Pyogenic lesion. Absolutely. This is in contact. This will cut anything yeah. now i want to go back to something because people have seen this uh which i i can't believe that you uh, did this already i used to teach when you're doing this and there's smoke with it yeah we take a wet gauze pad and put it on there absorb it why don't you talk about how you resolve okay this i've resolved that problem because if you go to ebay hey i call it um wonderful world my google uncle best uncle has given me is my Google uncle, right? Google uncle is the best uncle you could ever get, right? You, if you go to eBay or Amazon, you can buy nowadays portable fume extractor. I'm, uh, so it's so portable. One of the video, I have actually explained that. So if any one of you interested, are you possible to can you get to that and just show them a little show them the product uh, you did a you did a video for me yeah is i it, did a video um let me see if i can, if, can, uh, uh, if I, can uh, um, I don't know where it is that's okay uh, if anybody wants to see it we'll get it to him down the road but he's really resolved the smoke i mean you could really use a a vacuum cleaner or or anything or a fan but I like that device you have, and it's for, it's like $125. It's nothing. Yeah, it, okay. I think I've got it somewhere. Let me see which one. Yeah. You have it fine. If not, we'll, we'll, if okay. anybody wants to they can email me. That, um, I'm going to find somewhere. I, uh, okay. Uh, okay, so you, contact. you said to me, I want to contact the handpiece, and uh, it was from K Laser. You showed it to me. I said, We can make yeah. it. Okay, let me see because I, I made so many. Um, I know you do. You have your own studio. I couldn't believe it. I know. Um, so, therefore, um, <laughs> So in the future, we're going to be able to produce some high quality live videos of actual patient treatment. Yes, I am going to, if any, if it's any podiatrist very... want to learn, we probably can do, or, you know, online teaching with Remy. So we, we will see how it goes. Good. Okay. I, re I really like that. Um, does, uh, does anybody have any questions at this time? Uh, I, I see some of... Uh, a lot of Remy users online, but I'm mine limited with uh, uh, I'm limited with seeing the list. But so if anybody has any questions, feel free to ask. Uh, it's pretty straightforward. My goal tonight was to introduce you to Sumas. He's gonna um, 
you're going to get clinical education. When we talk about something, people are used to seeing me do it on my hand. Um, we're talking about actual treatments. Pain is, is still amazing uh, to me. And I'm going to repeat it one more time with pain. I don't care if you're, uh, the Remy is indicated for pain, inflammation, arthritis. He's got it here. Arth inflammation, arthritis, lack of mobility, and inflammation is an arthritis. It's so key, inflammation, if, plantar fasciitis, Achilles tendonitis, hallux limitus, any of the MPJ arthritis. Uh, there's a case that uh, we just, uh, that Dr. Barkoff just did, he sent to me, uh, if, you, if you follow Instagram, where he did a Freiburg's which is really a, a technically a form of arthritis. You know, uh, the goal of uh, laser therapy for the pain is to reduce, eliminate, and to delay. Uh, well, it's eliminate or reduce the use of injections, anti-inflammatory, but, but surgery. And even if you have surgery, the Remy is amazing post-surgical to reduce inflammation, which, which reduces um, uh, scar tissue. It reduces uh, superficial bacteria because the Remy does, um, uh, kill bacteria, you know, uh, the, all these lasers, especially the Remy, these pain lasers were uh, originally for, uh, for wound care. I didn't mean to drive you crazy with looking for that at all. I apologize. But uh, if I, I mean, I've seen you, we, we used it as part of our, um, if anybody wants the full video of it, where, where Sumas talks about the evacuator. Um, but you, we saw that video. I, I want you to put the video, if you can't find it, put the video back up of the warts because I, I want people to see this because I've had a uh, quite okay, a... Okay, let me just... Uh, I've had can, a you quite see, a, can you see the screen now? Because I, I can't see anything well, currently. Is it raining in the UK? Uh, no, it's okay in the UK. Is it this video? The, can you see the video now? No, I just see the umbrellas. Oh, oh you see you switched over this we well, have your desktop so it is switched over so are you seeing the video or no no not at ah. all i don't uh -huh. know why are you seeing I, the video no, now no, i want to make a comment this is without anesthetic there's no needle in that foot okay uh talk about how you you've uh moved from the probe you were telling me right now you're taking you're taking a chemical uh, ice pack. You're breaking it. Correct me if I'm wrong. Yep. You're putting it on the area you're going to treat for four or five seconds. Pull it back. Treat, treat, treat. Yeah. And we, 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 we just we're just using the pulse mode. So I'm using the foot pedal, right? Just just click pedal once, and then the beam will go in and vaporize the tissue. Okay, but it's also um, it's it's coagulating. There's no need. You didn't numbness, correct? No, I didn't do no numbness whatsoever. Let's talk about the results. I mean, uh, how, how many treatments is, is going on result, with this? One, one result was phenomenal. It was five years old boy. Five right? year old, right? Yeah. No, need, no needle. Uh, 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 and we used that. We used your technique with that boy. Touch the technique. Yeah, the touch. Right. And. Yeah. The parent called me about six, seven days later. They don't want to do follow up. It seems to fallen off. Right. How that bad was the how was that the video you showed me yet? You were doing a child. Yes, I I that's what the video when I was showing you doing on the child. Now let me ask you another question. What would you say the average? Uh, I mean, this may be difficult to answer. What's the average um, amount of set treatment sessions that um, are indicated? I mean. Do you know? I, I would say it depends. I, I say to the patient, you need to do at least three sessions to see if it's making any difference. So I, I, I do it three sessions in three weeks. Okay. So it's once a week. Yeah. Okay, let me ask you another question. They come in, how much debridement are you doing of the foot? I'm doing minimal debridement. I, I just don't want to bleed because otherwise laser yeah. is difficult to use so i i will do it until i see it's going to bleed right i i agree i i agree with the minimal debridement you know if you have any bleeding you got to stop it because the laser will absorb into the fluid the blood and won't absorb into the tissue yes. um so i mean um i i would i recommend telling it could be an average anywhere from one to ten treatments but the feedback i'm getting 
We have a Dr. Alvaria that's saying it's about three treatments. You know, yeah. uh, put the video up for a second. I want to show them something with this handpiece. Uh, okay. I want to show you something here. Okay, can you? Uh, I'm not, so. Uh, if you can. All right. Yeah. If you have the child, I'd love to see the child one. Do you have the child one? I think I have, but the problem is, um, you see, uh, it's. Um, I, there you go. I've got it. Yeah, show there the child. Go. Show There's the child. The this is and show the ice pack. Tell talk about what yeah. you're doing there. Five okay, year old, child, right? Five Let's years old. This is the Veruca. Where look, okay, so it's under the sesamoid area. It yeah. looks like a cluster. Yeah. How many? How many are there? Just one currently. Another one is popping up the other side, but I'm just doing currently one. Okay. So I'm so using you're... your method, touch. Okay. Let's talk about the um See, I find on the heel, because I've done this on myself, it's not too bad with or without ice. Dr. Yeah. Alvaro uses no ice at all. So are you, you so you're holding the ice in one hand. Yeah. Talk about, talk about punching, punching with another. Okay, so how often do you put that ice on it? Just where, as I, it's a practitioner's choice. Because yeah. remember, you can't put too much, too much, uh, too cold because it will freeze the area. I just wanted to cool the area, not okay. to freeze it. Let's do this. So you take the ice pack, you break it, you lay yeah. it. Are you laying it in front of the wart or on top of the wart? Sorry, I can't hear because of the. My dog barking. I'm sorry. No, because of the music. Okay, so it looks like you're putting the ice, you're holding the ice and you're putting it right on the area you're going to treat. Yes. For for a so, few seconds. so the boy, the boy doesn't. It's just to have the discomfort. I don't want the boy to be dis, um, discomfort. So okay, if so I am cooling seconds, the skin, he won't many, feel that much warmth. How many seconds are you putting that ice pack on that just ward? Lit literally few seconds. If you can see, look, touch, 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 on, off, on, off. Can you see on, off? Yeah, I see it. So you touch, yeah. touch. That's the key. Yeah. You got to pull that handpiece back because if you hover over it, even the aiming beam will admit warmth. It's the warmth that hurts. It's not the laser. Yeah. It's, it's warmth. the warmth that hurts. Thank you. I want to show something here is that this is the, the he's using the Remy handpiece. What he's done is he's taken off the therapy. And within seconds, he's put on. He calls it touch, touch. This is a fiber optic that he's doing pull back, pull back, pull back. Now, the new hand piece. How do, um, I have a question for the host. How do I see myself in the screen? I see you now. No, I can't see myself. I don't know. Um, I can tell you how. <laughs> Wait a minute. You got to, hey, Sarah, can you help him? I can't uh, get rid of you. You that again? Get off, get off your camera. I can't, I can't see the screen. What did you need help with, David? I don't I, know. I need I need help to see David. I, I, I currently I don't know which button to press. Um. So if you click on see on your um on your computer in your like your um tools where you normally have like app shortcuts, your go to webinar icon should be there. If you click on that. That should do the trick. Webinar icon. Mm -hmm. On the bottom of your screen where you normally have like your shortcuts. Shortcut. shortcut. <laughs> uh, you can't. Just know the camera. Camera. Yeah, I can't. As I said, I, 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 somehow when I play the video, it, I, I can't see myself or you. I could okay. only hear. Hmm. Okay. So yeah, I mean, let's, it's just, it's probably just hiding somewhere on your desktop, but I just, since I can't, I just I don't. Can, think I, it. It's not that important uh, and you can hear okay. us. Yeah, but I, I could hear you. Point, I want to make a point here is that this hand, this is the sp spider vein. It's very similar to the, uh, the, the Sumas hand piece and you just put it on like this and <laughs> The, the wart one has a uh, spot si uh, zoom spot size where you can adjust it, similar to this one when you just, um, it's got, see, I lift this up and I can turn this and change the spot size. And what's beautiful with the new handpiece, 
uh, for warts, you can adjust it to a seven millimeter and will replace, the, it can replace <laughs> this one, the fungus. So if you cut it down to two hand pieces, I guess I'm lazy. I, I, I like uh, less movement. So we have this one now, which is very effective, but the, the sumus hand piece, you can replace this and just adjust the spot size. And they all can be steam sterilized if you want to. Is it necessary? No, but it has that option to steam sterilize it. Um, Simmons, do you have anything else do you want to add to this or, or comment? Yeah, uh, it, it, yes, it's just I can't see myself. Anyway, uh, let me see if you can see. This is what I use called cool pack or instant ice pack. Any instant ice pack, you can get it from uh, a supplier. And that's what I use to cool the skin, right? Uh, or any, um, you know, small size area, we call it tip therma. That piece is cold piece. Where do you so get is, that? This is we use for diabetic foot. We take test for the warmthness or coldness. So we say, is it cold or is it normal? So this tip is a bit so you're colder. Not you're not freezing that? You're just taking it out? No, and using you just just cooling the skin because this is a metal piece, which is it's quite cold. So because you can actually metal. put... Yeah, because it's, that, it, it's, it's, it's quite cool. It's cool the area. That's all okay. I'm looking for. Slightly coolness, but again, when you are using instant ice pack, make sure that you don't put too much near the skin because this will you don't want you don't want the screen to be frozen. You just want to cool the area. So just touch, touch. I got you. I understand that. Now, if if somebody that's attending tonight wants to get the diabetic probe, you they can reach out to you and you can show them where to get it. I I well, they don't technically need it, but they can, any metal, there's a lot of things on the web they can buy it to cool the skin. It's got, a beautician use it to cool the facial skin. It's a metal. So it's in <laughs> eBay for about five pounds or something like that. And it just cools the skin. Gotcha. But could you help them? Because I had a hard time finding it, to be honest with you. Okay. You yeah, not a problem. I can give them a link in eBay. They can get it from eBay. Good. That's not a problem whatsoever. I, pre I appreciate that. So I actually, I see you as a video and I can't see the questions anymore. So I'm going to uh, uh, shut up. There all actually the haven't been any questions that have come through yet, David. Um, okay, so so we're down. I mean, that's okay. That, that's fine. If nobody has a question, uh, I see everybody staying on there. Uh, I mean, it, this is plain up front, natural conversation. I think people can get what they want out of it. Um, I'm ready to cut the, the cut the night off. I mean, uh, you know, it's we've over 45 minutes. Yeah. You know, I'm here to just take up people's time. I want them to learn something, but I do think warts are something that has really uh, we've really refined in it, uh, and the results are are pretty good. I think it's just as good as any uh, any wart treatment out there, and it's uh, it's not cutting, no anesthetic, no cutting, <laughs> which to me is important, and no anesthetic. So. Um, I'm going to say good night. Uh, Asubis, I appreciate very much you coming on. It's it's uh, well after midnight for you. And um, I want to say good night. I appreciate it. If anybody has any questions or or they can reach out to me, I can forward anything to Sumis. Um I think uh, we we already have my uh, my email is David Zuckerman DPM at gmail.com. If you want to text me or call me, it's 856. 229-2939. And most important, I want to thank everybody for taking the time to come out. And I hope I added uh something uh you know to your practice. Okay. Thank you for having me on the your platform, especially USA. And to all my colleagues who is currently listening to us with USA, you're most welcome in the UK if you wish. <laughs> I appreciate it. Good night, everybody. Thank you. Thank you. Good night. Bye-bye.